humbled to share this time with you as we honor the sacrifices of our veterans, and I'm overjoyed to see our young cadets heeding the call to service. Today, we honor every man and woman who has ever worn the uniform of our nation's military, those who courageously protected our freedom and fought for justice throughout our history. We come together to express our deepest gratitude for the sacrifices and contributions you and your family have made for our country. We salute the service of all veterans, and we keep in our thoughts and prayers those who have fallen, those who are missing, and those who are currently serving in harm's way. We also remember that honoring you for your service isn't just about what we say or do here today, but about how we honor our veterans and our nation every day of the year. As superintendent of schools, I want you to know that it is a sacred priority in Klein ISD to work together with our families and our communities to bring up children who love our nation, who honor your sacrifice, and who cherish the freedom we have in the best country in the world, the United States of America. How do you feel being next to so many veterans from the war and being here and everything that the RTC did? Yes, today was such a wonderful day to celebrate our veterans in Klein ISD. It was so exciting to see so many of them come out so that they could get to see how much we love and appreciate their sacrifice. And I'm just so proud of our students, uh, everyone from all of our ROTC, our kids in the choir. I mean, just all the hard work and effort that went into making sure that our veterans know that we love and appreciate them, not just on Veterans Day, but every day of the year in Klein ISD. How do you feel that the school made all of this for you? How honored do you feel and everything that happened? I, I think it's just great that Plan ISC celebrates veterans on uh, Veterans Day. This is a phenomenal program put on by our JROTC units. And uh, it, it just has a special heart uh, or a special place in our heart to be able to uh, come here and enjoy this presentation. How many years did you serve in the war? Uh, <clears throat> this is the 21st year of uh, the Pass and Review, the Veterans Day celebration. I've been to 15 of them. Okay. So, how did it feel to be next to many veterans from the war and this, like, everything the school did for them today? Yeah, I mean, I would say it's an honor, right? You know, we're all lucky to be in a country and have people that are uh, willing to put their life on the line for our, for our freedom, so it felt great. Okay. Most important, all veterans that are with us today, good morning. Welcome to the 21st Veterans Day ceremony celebration. Thank you for allowing us to my name is Tom Reitmeyer, okay, perfect. and I served in the U.S. Navy from 65 to 69 aboard a ship. It was a light cruiser, and we served tours of duty in uh, Vietnam, and uh, we did shore bombardment. And we had also we carried a down pilot uh, helicopter that uh, went on several missions to pick up down pilots uh, in Vietnam. And we made two tours in the period of time that I was aboard ship. I served in the missile division. Uh, I was a, an officer in charge of the what they called the missile house. We had a capacity for 120 surface-to-air missiles designed uh, specifically for aircraft, but they were not, uh, we did not actually use any missiles during that time other than testing them. Uh, we weren't required to do that. We had uh, also had a, a tour of the Mediterranean while we were out, but that seemed like a vacation compared to Vietnam. Okay. How does it feel for you to see all these people making honor to you and the rest of the veterans that fought in war? This is a terrific experience. Uh, when we were in Vietnam and coming back from Vietnam, 
it wasn't very often uh, that we were congratulated for our service. That was a period of time. And this has been uh, a wonderful experience for people like myself that are over 80 and have that experience. And I'm sure uh, people that are in the service now, and I think uh, it's a worthy tribute, especially to those that are serving today. So, as a teacher for the choir, how did it feel to be in front of so many veterans of the war and do this for them? It's such an honor to get to sing and to provide beautiful music um, as a small gift to pay back our veterans and to get to honor our country and um, to represent Klein ISD today. Thank you. 